Welcome to Spoken Reviews, home of the Spoken Reviews. Today, guys, we have a quick review of the Shark NV750. All right, guys, and the reason I actually went out and got the Shark is because my old Dirt Devil, which I got probably in 2011, has crapped it on me, which is fine. Uh, it did good. I, you know, had it for you know five years, and I think it cost around seventy bucks, maybe eighty bucks. So goodbye to the Dirt Devil. Hello to the Shark. All right, guys, let's open it up and see what's inside. So first, on the top, as you can see, this is the caddy. So whenever you use the uh, vacuum in the canister mode, you can just lay it on here, and you can it's supposed to like drag and go with you. So here's the caddy. Uh, here is another box so let's see what's in here okay so here's one of the extensions to clean with of some sort so I'll figure that out later that here and then here it's actually really cool this was the, the free promo that they had going on so you got this shark swivel um, steamer vacuum contraption. So I'll probably use this on the towel. So looks pretty cool and you know for free can't beat it. I know they probably have it built in the price somewhere but this month they had it included. So hey, it's a win. So I'll put that down there and then here the fun part. So, it's a little heavier than I thought. So let's take that out. Okay, and have it upside down. No, no, okay. So, and here is the new toy, domestic toy, the new vacuum. So let's go ahead and uh, open this guy up. All right, guys, let's go ahead and dive in to the actual box. So cardboard, and here we have some instructions. So yeah, probably important stuff, but I'll worry about that stuff later. Uh, an attachment. So here's a really cool one. This is supposed to be for like the fabric. So like whenever you want to clean your thick area rugs or like your couch, you use this one. So and we'll definitely test that out. Up there, what we have here, this seems to be the, what is this, okay, okay, so this is kind of like the, the handle main part piece, so you can see it's pretty long and stretches, so that's right there, it's pretty cool, I'll put that down, but now, so, more cardboard, and I'm always amazed at how they are so good at packing this stuff. So, here is the, the little bottom unit piece, kind of like the station of it. So, yeah, looks, looks pretty good. I'm not the hugest fan of the color, but who cares? It's a vacuum, it's supposed to be the best, so that's what I'm expecting. And here is the main piece there. So, and so here is like the heart of the vacuum right here. The motor part. So yeah. Looks nice. And then just have a couple more attachments. So to like to clean in the crevices. And Another attachment. So yeah, comes a pretty good amount of attachments. Um, so yeah. So now that I've taken everything out and made somewhat of a mess, I'm going to put it together, come back, and we're going to start cleaning and reviewing. All right, guys. So putting this vacuum together is extremely easy. Just like this little pamphlet shows, four steps. Literally, you can put the whole thing assembled together in a matter of seconds. So. Definitely a plus for ease of use. I did it without even looking at the instructions. Definitely a plus right there. 
All right, guys, here we have it. The old and the new. Old and new. Dirt Devil, you've been good to me. I appreciate you, but it's time to get my shark on. All right, guys, and just like they advertise on the commercials, this is a three, three in one. So there's three different ways you can use this vacuum. Uh, the first way is going to be where you can just drag the canister around with you so while you're vacuuming, you're supposed to be able to just kind of pull it like that and it just kind of drags. So that's the first way. The other way is you can vacuum like this and have it in your hand, which is the other way. And then the kind of the standard way most people are used to is just simply vacuuming just like this. So definitely a plus on the versatility of the vacuum. All right, guys, just to show you some close-ups. Um, it looks really, looks really good. Um, pretty good looking vacuum. Um, as you can see, the base, I'm gonna turn it on for a sec. So, as you can see, it has the LED lights up front so you can kind of like see under stuff and make sure you're getting a good job on the cleaning. So definitely a plus on that. Do a little pan up action going on, but yeah. Just from an aesthetic standpoint, this is definitely a very good looking product. All right guys, so part of the whole shark appeal is the vacuum being really versatile and being able to turn super easy. So I'm just gonna kind of show you that so I'm gonna demonstrate that real quick. So as you guys can see, uh, as far as being versatile, just like they advertise on TV, it's versatile. Uh, it's actually lighter than I thought. I was kind of afraid it'd be feel a little heavy, but just kind of using it in a small area, it's very light, one hand use. Um, you know, definitely a plus on that aspect. All right, guys. So with the traditional vacuum, if you want to get under the couch, you can't. You'd have to actually physically move the furniture, the couch, or anything like that. Uh, one of the big perks of the shark is you can easily go under furniture without moving it, so it's very versatile. As you can see, you can go underneath there. That function alone is a huge perk and you know, definitely keeps you from you know, having dirt and clutter on the couch because you have no excuse. Before, the excuse is on with the couch, but now you really don't have an excuse. So definitely a thumbs up on this feature and function of the Shark. So keeping your baseboards clean can be a struggle sometimes, but the Shark has a really nice attachment that you just put on like this. And you can see, you just flip the button. So you can see it's really easy to do. And it's really cool when you do the baseboards, there's actually another light that comes on so you can guide yourself and make sure you get all the dirt. So. Another plus and pro for the shark. So this upholstery cleaner is another really cool attachment that the shark comes with. Uh, you can easily clean your couches or any type of things, curtains too. Just put it on there and you just...
Yes, I've seen a really good job with doing that. And you have this fabric right here on both sides, which helps with the uh, cleaning. But yeah, definitely another really cool plus. So this is another really cool attachment that it comes with, and you can use this for your blinds. So like you see, I just attach it to here. You can see this type of attachment really makes it easy to keep your blinds clean. So another really cool plus for the shark. So everyone knows that keeping events is always the easiest thing to do. So I'm going to kind of pan up so you can see I have this vent right there. And I'm going to use the uh, shark to clean it to kind of show you guys how easy it is to do. So I'm just going to get right here. Push the button. And just like that, very easy to do. Uh, I haven't, you know, had a chance to get up there and clean it, but now I can easily do it on a regular basis, so I don't have any excuse anymore. So definitely another plus for the shark. All right, so everyone loves to clean flans. Not. Uh, well, no more excuses because now you have the shark with the extension. So just like this. As you can see, it's pretty nice and easy to do. Um, yeah, I mean, definitely easier than climbing up there and wiping it down and having to clean up all the dust afterwards. So, definitely a plus. These attachments are great. They are awesome. Definitely loving it. All right, guys. So the question I have is, how much dirt does it actually get? So, simply push this button here. Uh, have it over the trash can. You guys can kind of see what's going to go on here, and then you just push that lever, it opens up, and you can dump it out. So, oh, that's a lot of dirt. Oh, that's disgusting, but yeah. Pretty nice and easy to clean out. Little shake, shake, shake. Yeah. So. Okay, so now this is all cleaned out, and whew, you guys can see the amount of dirt I was able to get. So just for a graphical standpoint, the first time I used it, I was able to get this much. So in case you guys are wondering how much dirt does it pick up and dust. This is how much, so yeah. Good to know, and I can't believe that this was here before, and now I'm catching it. Just lets me know how shitty my old vacuum was, but just so for everyone who was wondering, that's how much dirt it picks up. All right, so here's the invoice for my purchase. You guys can see what I paid. Uh, the vacuum was 250, came with a free lifetime warranty, which to me is a huge plus. Uh, the attachments, the caddy, uh, the under appliance, and also I got the free little shark steamer tool. So all in all, the total was 286, which to me is really good value. Um, you can buy these from the store. I know Best Buy, Costco, they sell them pretty much the same price, but you're not gonna get the free lifetime warranty, which is a huge plus, and you're not gonna get the free shark steam vac action going on. I'll probably do a review of this later. Uh, so it's up to you to decide. I personally think it's a better value to get it from the directly from the website, especially when they have different promotions going on. Um, 
But yeah, overall, I'm extremely impressed with the short vacuum. I was somewhat skeptical, but since they had a return policy, I figured, hey, why not try it out and see? Since I needed a vacuum because the other one crapped out. But now that I've been using it for a while, I am pleasantly surprised. Uh, I definitely see the value for the price for the lifetime warranty. This is definitely a great value, guys. Anyways, guys, thank you for watching this review. If you like it, please hit the like button for me. If you have any questions, comments, please leave them below. And if you want to see more great reviews like this, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Thank you, guys, and have a great day. Welcome to Spoken Reviews, home of the Spoken Reviews. Today, guys, we have a quick review of the Shark NV750. All right, guys, and the reason I actually went out and got the Shark is because my old Dirt Devil, which I got probably in 2011, has crapped it on me, which is fine. Uh, it did good. I, you know, had it for you know five years, and I think it cost around 70 bucks, maybe 80 bucks. So goodbye to the Dirt Devil. Hello to the Shark. All right, guys, let's, let's open it up and see what's inside. So first. On the top, as you can see, this is the caddy. So whenever you use the uh, vacuum in the canister mode, you can just lay it on here, and you can you're supposed to like drag and go with you. So here's the caddy. Uh, here is another box. So let's see what's in here. Okay, so here is one of the extensions to clean with of some sort, so I'll figure that out later. That here. And then here, it's actually really cool. This was the, the free promo that they had going on. So you got this shark swivel um, 